Everybody's got to have a piece of pie that's just the right size. Because look, the big piece is way too much for Cat to eat. He'd never finish it. And if he tried, he'd get a stomach ache. Right, Cat? Oh, yeah. The small piece isn't nearly enough for me. I could gulp it down on like one bite and I'd still be totally hungry. But it's just the right size for Cat. And the big piece is just right for me. Everybody's got a piece of pie that's just the right size. So we're all ready to start our perfect picnic with a pig, right? Wrong, because look! Wow. There are one, two, three of us, but one, two, three, four pieces of pie. So there's an extra piece and that's a big problem. One little piece of pie, just sitting there all alone, with nobody to eat it. Nobody, nobody, nobody! What? Hello. Yes, no, every piece of pie has somebody. Get over here, you amazing cat. You got a chicken. He got a chicken. Tell everybody how you solved the problem. I got a chicken. You got a little chicken to go with a little piece of pie. And so, problem solved. The problem is solved. We solved the problem. Problem solved. Yeah. Now we can have our perfect picnic with a pig. The sun's shining, the pie smelling sweet, and the chickens are running wild. Chickens running wild? Cat, did you leave the door to the chicken coop open? Didn't the farmer say not to leave the coop open no matter what because the chickens will get out and they're 100 chickens and that's a lot? Looks like we've got a really big problem. We've got to get 100 chickens back into the coop before the farmer sees. So let's all carry as many chickens back home to the coop as we can. Ready? Where is that pig? Okay, I know you're not used to solving problems because you're a pig, but we've got a job to do, so let's do this thing. Picking up chickens, one chicken, calling all chickens, come to me. Peek-a-boo chicken, come out of that shoe. Picking up chickens, now I got two. Picking up chickens, one, two, three. I got chickens all over me. Now take your chicken to the coop and be quick. A chicky, 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 chick, chick. <laughs> We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten chickens back into the coop. <laughs> now we just have to get. Whoa. There are still so many chickens. 100 really is a lot. It's like way more than 10. 10 is way less than 100. Don't worry, Cat. 
We'll get those chickens in there somehow. We won't give up. We won't chicken out. We... <laughs> <laughs> I said chicken out. <laughs> and they're all chickens. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, check the corn and check the chicks. After the farmer checks the corn, he's gonna check the chickens. Come on, chickens, get back into the coop right now. These crazy chickens think the farmer's a chicken playground. Cheep, cheep. <gasps> Cat, if chickens like games, let's have a chicken race. Okay, chickens, when I say go, run to the finish line where Cat is standing. One, two, three, go! Cheep? <gasps> no! You chickens aren't supposed to come back out. You chickens are supposed to go in. These chickens are driving me totally crazy. <laughs> Hi, Ramon. So you're helping out the farmer today? I've invented these new plant foods to make the farmer's plants grow big, bigger, biggest. That is so awesome, Ramon. Thanks. Oh, um, Ramon, could we borrow those wheelie things you got there to get the chickens back into the coop? The chickens got out? Yeah, all 100 of them. That's a lot. Yeah, it's like way more than 10, right? Ramon is so helpful. He's always there when you need him. Always helping everybody out. Anytime, any place, in any way. He's really, 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 really helpful. I do what I can. Hop in, little chickens, hop in. Wow. Back to inventing new farm products. He sure is helpful. <gasps> That's the farmer. Let's push these wheelie things. Cat, pig. Pig? <sighs> when you need help solving a math problem, don't ask a pig. Okay, one, two, three, push! The pig and cat can't push those big heavy wheelbarrows, so we can't push the chickens. When the farmer sees 100 chickens out of the coop, he'll be mad, they'll be sad, I'll feel bad. I am totally freaking out. Cat's right. I should count backwards from five to calm down. Five, four, three, two, one. The pie. That's it. You did it again, you amazing genius. Mm -hmm. When we set up the picnic, everybody had something to eat that's just the right size, right? We should make sure everybody has something to push that's just the right size, too. Cat really is a genius to think of these things. He should be at some huge university. Wearing a bow tie and talking about algebra and the president and opera and the stock market and... <gasps> Gonna get untangled and check the chicks. <gasps> Hurry up! Everybody find the wheeling thing that's just the right size. Go! Does this look right? No! Cat wheelie thing is too big. Does this look right? No, both their wheelie things are too big. Does this look right? Yes, we all have something to push that's just the right size. So hold on tight, little chicken chicks. You're going home. Cheep, 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 cheep. Way home. Because we put big with big and small with small, we're totally moving 100 chickens. Math really saved our tails. Cheep, 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 cheep. We're here. Which means... Problem solved. Cheep. The problem is solved. Cheep, cheep. We solved the problem. So everything is awesome. Problem solved. Cheep. Looks like my 100 chickens are safe and snug in their coop. So, can I join your perfect picnic with a pig? You sure can. Cheep, cheep. You can have a perfect picnic with a pig. 
when little goes with little. And big with big. You can have a pear and apple plumber fig. When little goes with little. I'm red, red, red. You can wear a giant hat or little beanie. When big goes with big. And teeny goes with teeny. Let's all do a wild and crazy jig. If you're little, go with little. Something that is just the right size. I really gotta stop and shout and wiggle and charge. When somebody who's super big has something really large, we can't see someone very small with something itty bitty. He turns into a shake a shake a shake a shake a giddy. A shake a shake I do. Rocky Scrabble So that's our perfect picnic with the bag. Cat and friends. into a crater. But we have no idea which one. We've got a big problem. <laughs> we were having such a good time. It's okay, Richard. We'll find my marble. I'll check inside this first crater. <gasps> Can I check inside the second crater? Sure, and Cat will check inside the third. Ready? Set. <laughs> we found my marble. So, ooh, ooh, ooh. can we bounce while we sing? Please, please, Peg. If I bounce, I might lose my marble totally forever. Not if it's in my safe. A safe is a box that locks when you close it, so you can keep things safe. My safe only opens when it says 100. That's one, zero, zero. Whoa. Hello, Richard Splanky. I never use it. I just like the notes there. My marble is safe in the safe. So, problem solved. The problem is solved. Hello. We solved the problem, problem solved. Cat, is that weird spaceship you waved at coming towards us? Uh, yeah. You weren't gonna leave me all alone with that scary spaceship, 
were you? No way, no. Richard. We're gonna stay right here and face that space creature or space monster or... Cheep, 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 cheep. One hundred chickens and a pig? Mmm, baby corn. You crazy chickens built a spaceship and followed us here? Cheep, cheep. I'm Richard. Here's a rock I ride on. Here's a rock I rock on. You chickens don't belong in space. You belong on the farm with the farmer. Shh. Yeah. Shh. Hey, Richard, who's that? That's just a big mouth. Don't worry about him. He only eats things that are little and yellow. I'm glad I'm not little and yellow. Me too. I know. <gasps> the chickens! <laughs> Go back to your spaceship, chickens! <laughs> that way! Cheek, <laughs> cheek. Get all 100 chickens back into their spaceship before Big Mouth gets them. We've got a really big problem. Another problem. Oh, sheesh. Don't worry, Richard. We'll solve the problem. We just need an idea. Does the pig have an idea? Nope. Just a burp. Oh. Oh. Hey, Peg. Hey, Ramon. Cool jetpack. I'm collecting space rocks for NASA. Can we see? Ooh. Nice. Want to see me add 100 of these rocks to my collection? Counting 100 rocks will take all day. One, uh, two, uh, three. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> And be very difficult. Not if I use these trays. Each tray holds ten rocks. So, instead of collecting rocks one at a time, I pick them up ten at a time. Like this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten rocks! Now I'll count by tens and collect one hundred rocks in no time. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. Wahoo! Whoa! Hey, Ramon, do you think we could pick up 100 chickens 10 at a time and bring them from the other side of the mountain to their spaceship? Sure. Everybody take a couple trays. And take a seat. Wait, before we blast off, I need to check in with a friend. One, zero, zero. Special Marvel Spin. Up, up, down low. Way to go. Stay smooth, cool, and sparkly. I love that marble. Take your trays and scoop up chickens ten at a time, like this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten chickens! I have a tray with ten. I have a tray with ten. I have a... Big mouth! I do not have a big mouth. Mm. Ah! 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, wahoo! <laughs> Big Mouth way behind in the purple dust. 
<sighs> I need to rest. I need to get back to work collecting space rocks for NASA. Thank you so much, Ramon. I do what I can. Are you going to burp again, Pig, or do you have something to say? What is it? Beneath your back. Beneath this what? Come on, just say it. Side. Beneath his backside? <laughs> no! We got to get these chickens in their spaceship now. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. What do I do? I said 90. I said 100. Let's attach the chicken spaceship to ours so we could lead those chickens home. Richard. Coming, Mom. Bye, Peg. Bye, Cat. Bye, Richard. We better take off fast before Big Mouth comes back. <laughs> My special marble! <laughs> the safe won't open unless it says 100. But I forget which numbers you need to write 100. I will get my marble back. The farmer won't get his chickens back because there'll be Big Mouth snack. I am totally freaking out! <laughs> That's right. I should count backwards from five to calm down. Five, four, three, two, uh, uh, one. Uh, That's it. You made a one, zero, zero. That's 100. You did it again, you amazing genius cat. One, zero, zero. Special marble, I missed ya. The chicken spaceship is stuck because Big Mouth is back. No! Yes! Baby corn. One little yellow thing coming down. By knowing 100 is 100, zero, zero, we save my marble. And by counting by tens, we save the chickens. So. The problem is solved. We solve the problem. The problem solved. To get to planet Earth, head towards the galaxy that looks like the number 100. Hey, Pig, 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 or the three that I see over here, no. We know where to go, so let's totally cheer. Oh, 100 is 100. Zero, zero. Peg is my pal. And Cat is my hero. 100 is 100. Zero, zero. 100 is 100. 100 is 100. 100 is 100. Zero, zero. PBS Kids Friends on your local PBS station and the free PBS Kids video app. Also, subscribe to the PBS Kids Prime Video channel.